Hello, and welcome to my new and improved room. I've got, quite frankly, I've got a lot of purple. <laughs> I've got a chair. A chair. I feel so suave and sophisticated on my chair, except people who are suave and sophisticated don't sit like this. Yeah. And, um, oh, look at the painting. Oh, you can't see the painting. Well, it's just, it's up there and it's quite nice. I like it. Um, my whole room matches my iPod now. And there's the painting. And, um, the room's purple. Because you may have noticed it's going to be on, on all of my sign off videos now. But there was like a purple streak there where we were like testing the paint. And it will forever be there in my sign off videos if I continue to use them. Different curtains, different bed covers, different pillows, different sheet thing, different cat. No, that's the same one. Oh, and I got this thing. Yep. This huge thing instead of the wardrobe and whatnot. It's it's much easier. I like it very much. I do, I do. I look like I think I'm superior to everyone. Oh, okay, I'm gonna sit up. Hi. Oh, I'm so annoying. <laughs> In other news, clumsy bumbler twit. That is what I'm thinking of legally changing my name to. That is Olivia Caress. She is one of the clumsiest girls you will ever meet. I mean, I'm just a walking calamity. I can't take two steps without falling or veering off course. Is there a problem, officer? Are you aware that you were going under the speed limit, ma'am? Well, isn't that a good thing? I'm gonna need you to walk the line, miss. Please walk the line. Walk the line, miss. Please walk the line. I really don't think this is necessary. Walk the line! Oh, okay, okay, alright, okay. Okay, I've seen enough. I'm taking you in, miss. No, I'm not drunk! I'm not drunk! I'm just cl I'm just clumsy! More often than not, rather than watching where I'm going, I'll just walk into something. I mean, it happens in work too. It's it's really bad. I was searching for a customer, and when I spotted her, I did a double take, and I ended up stumbling. I was able to write myself just before she saw me. And then, as I was coming out of an office, I just bumped into a pillar. Walked on like nothing happened. I think that's probably the best solution to problems of clumsiness. Either act like nothing happened or just laugh it off. <laughs> Except not in the policeman scenario, that could end badly. I've actually learned to accept myself as a bumbler and I think it adds to my copious amounts of charm, wouldn't you agree? You don't agree? Okay, sure, that's fine. If I have to fall over and hurt myself to be happy, then so be it. That reminds me of a certain friend of mine's hope that the first time I ever get drunk, I'll fall over and cut myself. Aren't friends the best? You know who you are. And yes, I've never actually been drunk. I'm almost 18, and I've never been drunk. And I consider that a good thing. And I don't intend to get drunk on my 18th birthday. It's not really a high thing on my to-do list, to be honest. I'm not going to get into the whole sober v drunk argument now, because... Yeah. Maybe I'll make that a subject on another video. That could work out. Anybody else clumsy? No? Okay then, bye-bye. A goodbye is better than a bye-bye All so Voldy, kill it! Kill it, Voldy! Expelled. 